One of the biggest lifestyle changes when the pandemic hit was movie going. Theater shuttered, many for good. But Fox on my team's Dana Fowles says that for those that reopened, some of it may look a little bit different to us, Dana. Yeah, movie theaters have been feeling pressure for a while, even mm -hmm. before the pandemic. I mean, tickets for a family of four, then snacks. It really is a pricey night out. And then they had to compete with the ease of just watching movies at home. Add on to that the pandemic, which caused shutdowns. And that just about did a lot of theaters in. But the survivors, AMC, have a plan. AMC is the nation's biggest movie chain. It's starting a three-tiered ticket pricing plan. Those seats up front, they're going to cost less and will be called the value seats. Those good seats in the middle, uh, that's going to cost you more and they'll be called preferred. And then there will be somewhere in the middle there something called standard seating. It's called the sightline plan. It will roll out throughout the year and it doesn't look like it'll affect matinees but rather the shows that play after 4 p.m. The website will show the seating options and the price tag that goes with that seat. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean, it kind of sounds like flying a little bit. I think so, too. It's the first yeah. thing I thought. Which uh, class? Yeah, which class are you <laughs> in? So maybe that's a way to get a deal, too. There's a couple ways to look at it. You put the choosy family viewer in the preferred seats and the kids who don't care down in the value seats. And then I guess it's a way for the um, theaters to also make money. Say, hey, you know, everybody's got that choosy viewer. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm not sitting in the front. Yeah, ugh, the worst. <laughs> No thanks. No thanks. No. So they get more money from me and you. Right. But you get people this tall who can do that. And they're cool. And they're cool with it. So this was actually a hot topic for us. And I, I, I see where they're coming from because, you know, it makes me think of like a Broadway show. Or if you're going to see really anything in, in theater, then your seat, you're paying for where you are. So it makes sense. Right. Our viewers were not on board with this. Like overwhelmingly, our comments were from people that were like, Absolutely Well, not. listen to, I, and I think this plays into it. We went to a mall this weekend. My daughter and I popped into a mall. She's 13. She doesn't have huge mall experience. Mm -hmm. It just hasn't been part of her MO. We went through a really nice mall that was, by the way, Sunday at 1 o'clock, and just well, there was oh, hardly anyone wow. in there. And we walked past the theater, and my 13-year-old, she goes, oh, look, a movie theater. It like was it like, was I oh like, my gosh. Yeah, and she goes, oh, it's like she'd forgotten they existed. Wow. So that's the next generation. They've wow. got to do something to get them in, or I, I'm not sure they're going to be able to survive it in the way that you and I know movies. Right, right. It's expensive. You've got kids who don't go to the mall anymore. Yeah. And my 13-year-old who loves movies, I mean, looked at it like it was a relic. <laughs> She went, that's telling. And she stopped and paused and pointed and said, oh, look, there's a movie theater. A real live one. Right. <laughs> so it might not be a good idea for all of us sitting in here, sure. but for the next, they got to do something to bring them in. Absolutely. Yeah. That's so interesting. It was though. a shocking, I mean, I came home to my husband, like, number <laughs> one, she thought, why are we in a mall? What are we doing? <laughs> And she, we couldn't find anything to eat. Like, the, the whole thing was crazy. Like, it was had nothing to do with the way I grew up. Going to the mall, getting something to eat. Oh, that was everything. Checking out a movie. Right. Every one of these things was yeah. for You were, like, dying to go and right. do that and stuff. Every and part changed. of this for her was, like, what do we... It, it was like we went on, vac like, an exotic vacation. <laughs> We went to the mall and saw a movie theater. <laughs> Something else. Times have changed yeah. in a big so way. So there you go. All right. Dana, <laughs> thank you.